you all for, for coming here today. I want to thank Congressman Andrews and Senate President Sweeney for joining me as well. Bob Martin from DP is here as well and others. Uh, this is an issue that's extraordinarily important to the future of New Jersey. And we're here uh, united in our continued opposition to what uh, they want to do here on the Delaware River. This plan makes absolutely no sense. It makes no sense economically and it is dangerous environmentally. And we spoke for the last year, uh, and I was a relative newcomer to this, Senator Sweeney and Congressman Andrews have been fighting this fight for a very, very long time. I'm happy to join them in that regard. Uh, the assembly folks as well, I'm glad to join with them. This is not a partisan issue. This is an issue about the future of our environment, and this is an issue about New Jersey standing up for itself. Uh, there is no reason why project that will have no, I believe, no positive effect on the economy for the state of New Jersey, that New Jersey should wind up being the repository for the dredge spoils that are going to be created um, here by this project by the Army Corps of Engineers. And it's something that, as a state government, we are going to continue to fight against. Uh, I know that the Army Corps is preparing to start to move ahead with the project. Uh, we are not out of alternatives, and uh, the DP commissioner, myself, will work with the Senate President, and we'll work in coordination with Congressman Andrews to try to bring every every resource we have at our disposal to try to minimize the negative effect that this is going to have on the people of the state of New Jersey, and ultimately to try to stop it before it gets too far. Uh, we need to make sure that we protect New Jersey's environment, and especially here in South Jersey. We cannot have South Jersey be the spot where people are going from Pennsylvania are going to dump things on us. Well, we don't get any advantage out of that at all. And you can just look at some of the projects that have been done here on the waterfront, which I know Senator Sweeney will talk about, um, that have been a great use of these properties, not the kind of use that uh, the Army Corps of Engineers and the people of Pennsylvania want to put this uh, these kind of properties to. So I want you to know as governor that our administration stands four square in opposition to this project. We will continue to resources we have at our disposal to make sure that we put a stop to it. Um, I want to introduce my partner in the, uh, in the state government, the Senate President, Steve Sweeney, for some remarks, and then we'll hear from Congressman Andrews, uh, and then we'll be available to take some questions. So, Senator Sweeney. First, I want to thank Governor Christie for standing up for the people of South Jersey. This project was wrong when I first started, way back, Congressman, I guess in 1990. People of New Jersey need to be protected. We're doing some good things here. Along the waterfront in New Jersey, just down the road, is River Winds. That was where they were going to first dump the first, that was their first site. Here's the benefit to the community, which is a wonderful town center. We go down to Logan Township, it was the other location they were looking to dump all the spoils. We created a park called the Dream Park, where thousands upon thousands of people come and enjoy. We're creating ports. They said that this is needed to create jobs. We're creating ports right down the road at Port of Paulsboro is under construction right now. We're actually looking to create two other ports. And we're gonna work, work with Governor Christie to create those ports. So I wanna thank the governor for being here. This makes a loud, clear statement that we are not gonna be dumped on. This is wrong. It was wrong in 1998. It's wrong today. We need to create economic development along our river. We're not the trash can of South Jersey or this, this Delaware Valley region. We can create wonderful economic opportunities and passive recreational opportunities for the people of New Jersey to enjoy and jobs. So, Governor, I want to thank you personally for championing this, continuing this fight because it needs to be fought. So, thank you very much, Governor. had hair when we started this. He still does, but Rob Andrews on the federal level, you know, he's the one person on the, on the federal level that has never let up on us for this project. So, Rob, I want to thank you for that, and thanks for being here. Congressman Andrews. Good morning. Thank you, uh, Governor. It's an honor to have you with us. Thank you for your personal and intense interest in this. And Senate President Sweeney, you've been leader on this from the beginning. We've had great support from our assembly delegation here in the district as well. We thank you for that. This is not a choice between Republicans and Democrats. It is not.
not a choice between jobs and the environment. It is a choice between right and wrong. We can create jobs, more port jobs, by investing in piers and roads and rails and warehouses on both sides of the river, and we will. But this project does make no sense, and here is how we're going to work together to stop it. First, the fight is being waged in the courts. The prior administration in Trenton filed suit in federal court to stop this. To Governor Christie's credit, from the very outset, he and his team stepped in and have aggressively pursued that lawsuit in the federal courts in Trenton. We'll continue to work together with the Attorney General to make that happen. Second, we will fight this project. Senate President and all of us in the Congress, 